assalamu alaikum friends welcome to my channel and in this tutorial we are going to perform a new root tool that is in network analysis and we will find a shortest and quickest route between these two points or any other two points of your interest and if you want to know that how did i create this network data set on which we will perform all these analysis you can watch my previous video in which i have explained that how can you create a network data set just like this so this first of all before performing any network analysis you have to confirm that in customization and in extension is your network analysis in an uh, extension is enabled or disabled if it disabled then make sure that you have checked this one and then right click on your toolbar and enable network analysis tool so here I have a shape file of location that first location is starting and second is the end the destination so we will find a uh, route what it will be the shortest route between these two points and what will be the quickest route between these two points okay so for new route analysis just click over here and select the new route so over here these are the stops so if you you have your stops will located accurately then they will give this type of color and so on but let's see that how can you load locations or destination starting or ending position on a network data set so just this is the table of content of our window and this is the window of our network analysis you can add stop from over here just select the stop and choose this tool and you can add a temporary locations just like this so now if uh, in this uh, condition we have a shape file of our look uh, starting and ending position so let's see that how can you load a shape file as a starting and ending position just right click over here add location and our shape file name is location just like this location from over here and okay now you can see that our first position is starting and the second position is uh, ending position okay so now we have locations and now we will calculate the shortest route between these two points just go to the route properties and from here you can give name to your route shortest route and from here these are the properties of our data set and from here impedance will define either your route will be fastest quickest or shortest so if you want uh, to calculate the shortest route then select length in your impedance and from here these are the other characteristics of your route if you want to allow u turns then allow this one and from here this is accumulation if you will check this uh, length and minute then you will get the properties of your route like length of your shortest route and the time taken from one point to other point on shortest route uh, will calculate in attribute table and okay now just okay this and solve this now we have the shortest route between these two points and if i go to its attribute table then you can see over here we have the total length of this route and the total minutes okay now let's take a snip or screenshot of the characteristic or our properties of this route so we will make a comparison between shortest and quickest route after quickest route analysis okay now uh, we will calculate the fastest quickest route between these two points just go to properties of layer and you can name quickest and now impedance will be in time in minute rest of thing will be same and okay and solve this rule. Okay, now you can see over here the route has been changed and if i go to its properties okay now you can see the shortest route over here and this one is the quickest route 
okay let's make a comparison between these two routes you can see over here we have the shortest route here and the quickest route properties over here the total length in our shortest route is 15958 meters and in our quickest route the length of route is 19493 meters okay and the quickest route will take us from start to ending position in 15 minutes but the shortest route will take us from starting to ending position in 20 minutes so here's the major difference between a quickest and a shortest route in quickest route we have to cover more distance as compared to shortest route but the time period of uh, traveling the time period of traveling we will make a quick response in quickest route uh, but we have to uh, sacrifice our length and our petrol so in in shortest analysis uh, we can save our petrol our length but we have to sacrifice our time so for quickest response from one location to another location we can use quickest route analysis and if we want to save petrol and we want to cover less dis distance but we can sacrifice our time so we can perform a shortest route analysis on this okay now we are able to find a uh, shortest and quickest route between any two points now let's see what are these barriers over here so if i want that my route will not pass from this point so i will just click over here and with the help of this tool i will mar mark a uh, point over here and if i solve this tool now you can see now my route is not passing from this point over here and it, this is a quickest route and if i will again go to its, its impedance and select the shortest and i will solve this tool then you can see it has changed its location and now if i want that my route will not pass from this point this line from this line so if i will solve this route then you can see over here now my route is not passing from this line or from this point and now if i don't want to that my route will pass from this whole polygon and if i will solve this tool then you can see now my route is not passing even from this point line or polygon and now you can play with root analysis in arcgis so in the next video we will see that how can we perform a service area analysis in network analysis on the same data set i hope that you find this video very helpful and i would he I'd love to hear from you have you tried root analysis before in arcgis share your experience and any tip you have in the comment section and if you have any question or specific topic uh, you would like to tell me for future videos uh, just let let me know in comment section many thanks take care allah